Hi guys, my name is Nitish. Welcome to YouTube channel. And in this video, I have a really cool announcement to make. I am starting out a new playlist on solving problems on SQL. So in this playlist, we are going to solve standard problems from Lead Code, Hacker Rank, or any other platform you can suggest. The main motto behind creating this playlist is to develop the problem solving mindset and not just cram the solutions. I will I would strongly advise that while we are solving the problems you can pause the video try the solution on your own and you can come back if you have solved the problem with any other approach you can comment down and interact with other peers it will be a great win for everyone so without wasting much time let's get started let's start with problem combine two tables this is the first problem on lead code for sql so let's understand the problem statement we are given here two tables called person and address so person table contains uh, this set of columns person id last name first name the address table contains address id person id city state so person id here in the person table is primary key and address id is the primary key of address table person id here is referring as a foreign key for this table so what we are required is we are going to generate a report or we are going to display first name last name from this table city and state from address table okay so uh, what comes to your mind so if you are familiar with the basics of sql we will definitely use a join okay so let's write the statement select we need first name and last name okay in in, in that order so let's let me copy this first name last name this is from the person table let me write it p dot from person and then we need cd a dot cd a dot state okay from person p join address a on p dot person id equals a dot person id so we are joining this and we hope that all the information like first name last name city and state all will come and let's run this whoop so uh, we have got the wrong answer so let us understand what is the situation out here so the example in the example test case we have in the person table with people with person ids 1 2 and in address we have 2 and 3 so 2 only 2 is matching let's see only 2 is matching so that's why it has only uh, displayed the result for this person this should be a last name last name okay but still it is a wrong answer right we only have we only have the row printed for bob elise right bob elise so but what we want is we want the output the expected output is we want the row printed for this ellen wang as well okay and we know that ellen wang is not present in this table so in the problem statement if you observe it's written even if the address of person id if the person id is not present in the address table we have to report the null okay so what comes to your mind so there's a trick involved here we just need a different set we will we will require a different set of join that is called a left join okay so what happens in the left join is for the matching attribute that's person id even if the rows are even if the records are not matching the left side rows will come to the result as it is okay so let me explain to you is even if this person id like one it's not present in this address table then also this the details from this the details from this table will come into the result without even being a match so if we run this again boom 
it's accepted now right and let us submit the problem it's done right so that's it from this video we are starting with the easier problems and gradually we will move our levels in the in the next video we will solve another sql question until then bye bye and keep learning